I'm working on these two paintings. So this one I did an underpainting for like two days ago and I did this underpainting today. So I guess now I'm ready to start painting, like actual painting. <laughs> this is my sketch for this one. I finally figured out what I want to focus on this year um, at school, like a theme, topic sort of thing to explore. So my ideas kind of started going in that direction. So I'm hoping to not have as many problems with ideas and painting in general. <sighs> pigments it's so I got like a full gradation of it it's coral powder except it's not actual coral because that would be too expensive <laughs> uh, it's like a coral color oh I can't read this this is not good okay I figured it out it's red as a gosu Apparently a type of a type of porcelain. Am I working on two paintings at once? Yes. Does my hair look ridiculous? Also yes. Um, but I'm finally working on things and um, it's going really slowly. I can't work every day but we're getting somewhere. <laughs> and um, 
this month has also been really hard so I've had trouble talking to the camera <laughs> even though that's like the reason I started this channel I literally started this channel so that I wouldn't forget to speak and that I wouldn't lose my voice and so that I could express things and I did it because I was home from school and then this whole self-isolation thing started and it got even worse <laughs> and um, yeah but we are working through it so I'm painting and you're painting with me and I guess if you're watching this you're spending time with me <laughs> I want to talk, I really want to talk, but I have lost the ability to talk and um, so I'm just going to ramble. Um, so what I'm doing right now is putting back some of these pigments into their baggies because this is actually old paint and I extracted the binder from it yesterday and now it's dry and now I'm returning it to baggies and it's a really annoying process but it's necessary if i want to save the pigment otherwise i would just throw it away which is a giant waste because well they're really expensive so it's a really annoying job <laughs> like i hate doing it i keep putting it off and some of this is actually from <clears throat> from january which is not good, don't do that. I mean, not that anyone who watches this um, uses this paint, but... <laughs> oh yeah, it does feel good to ramble, though. It does feel good. I need to talk. I need to talk. Ah, the bag is too small. not fun which is why I guess it helps that I can ramble about it <laughs> the good news is that the state of emergency for Tokyo has been lifted so hopefully um, in about two weeks the school will reopen personally I'm not ready to go back back to school because this whole self-isolation thing has been basically like a giant kick to my anxiety so I lost a lot of my skills for you know being a part of society <laughs> so going back to school is gonna be really really difficult even though I can't wait to go back to school I also don't want to so, yeah, complicated feelings about that. But, yeah, I am painting and I'm working on ideas, I guess. And we're going to have our first, um, first exhibition and first critique is going to be, I think, the end of July or something like that. They kept moving it because, well, because of the situation. Anyway. 
I'm about to take this thing that I just mixed and I'm about to paint it or like I'm about to spread it all over this painting and it might end up being completely wrecked. But that is the risk I take all the time. I just, I need a bit more red in it and like red in the underpainting before I start the rest of the upper layers. So we have to do this. And the danger is that some of the details might get ruined because the binder might not have been um, strong enough, especially in this part. If it does, I'll have to, you know, go over it again, but that's just the way it is. Okay, okay, let's do it. Okay, I'm pleased with the risk taking, but we're gonna see um, how it's gonna look when it dries. So I did some more work and now they're drying. This one is already dry almost. And this one is drying. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna end it here and I'm gonna keep painting. I guess you'll see that in another 